we've gotten some new information pertaining to the new character customizer from this week's Star Citizen Live episode. In this video, we're going to cover those questions and answers. The very first question here is, is the character customizer going to bring more heads? And the answer was, all the heads that have been in the PU previously will be there. Some new are still there, but we are still polishing the face rigs. But we're working on 60 more heads as we progress through development. That's a lot. 60 is a lot. Um, I like, I think, yeah, this will give a lot of diversity um, from my perspective. We're also giving facelifts, increased skin detail, and updated skin tones and balanced maps. And we also apply skin tones over any skin textures. And we can also apply skin tones over any skin textures. So all in all, a lot more customization to design your character the way you want them to look like. The very next question is, we'll be able to customize our character menu only or we can change it again later in game. They said at launch, it will be through the character customizer only when you create your character, but we want to give you the option to also update the look of your character in game. So um, that's good. I like that. I like that. I don't, I don't, I didn't even expect it to happen in game anytime soon. I think it's probably going to be lower on their priority list as first of all, they want to get Star Citizen Alpha 1.0 out the door so I can see them um, having uh, features that have a higher priority than putting this in game. The very next question says, will these characters be wiped as well with future updates or will they be saved and persistent? And their answer is the character will be saved through future updates, but no promise as we might need to reset depending on issues that may arise. You'll also be able to export and import your customized character through the new feature that we are adding with 3.23. The, the um, export and import um, option is, I think it's a great move. I really like that. This way you can, you don't have to always have to um, cust re-customize the character every time to do a patch cycle. Um, it reached a point where I don't even bother going through all the options anymore. I just pick one and pick a skin tone, pick a hair color, and then I just move on with that because I don't want to go through the tedious uh, process of picking the exact features that I want. So this is a good update. The very next question is, will we be able to change the facial expressions, scene settings, lighting uh, in the review tab? U using a character customizer in general, I often found myself creating a beautiful tone just to learn how ugly it looks once it's placed into the actual game. That's a good question. Right now they say that there is no promises, but technically it's doable. They'll also keep the FOIP animations. The next question is, will beards use star hair? And it says definitely the full beards will have a degree of motion and collision with the chest. Next question is, is it possible to have very long hair? It says we have to limit the hair from a technical point of view. To the shoulders is our maximum to minimize clipping and issues with gameplay and the helmets that makes sense I, I i expected them to have some sort of limitation i mean i think what we have now with 3.23 is is sufficient um and next it says here by 3.23 you'll also um, be able to choose long hair put a hat or helmet or a cap on and the asset your hair will be replaced with a new asset still your hair but in another style like attached so it fits in your headgear your hairstyle is important so we want to make this a cool feature to automatically have your hair neatly packed when using a headgear that's cool i didn't expect them to do that honestly but that's cool the fact that they went um uh, into that level of detail when it comes to the player character's hair. Up next it says, what can you tell us about the feature beyond 3.23? And it says there's going to be more variety like mohawk, dreadlocks, and more. We want to release these features with updates. For example, pyro, it would be themed more piratey hairstyles, lawless, etc. 
if there is a specific style you would like to see let us know on twitter or spectrum the next question is body type heights and sizes what can you tell us about the different body sizes shapes tall short etc and they respond with it's a difficult problem to solve body shape customization is technically doable but it would impact a lot of gameplay clothes clipping and attachments it will be possible it would affect all the animations in the game causing a lot of issues i agree having everyone the same shape doesn't look right but we'll investigate with what we can do yeah right now like the way they customize the characters all the animations in, in terms of like entering the ship the um, pilot seat of ships have a certain size limitation right they're all built for the current uh, male and female character sizes right so uh, for them to allow the player character to have to be either fat tall or short um could also um cause issues i can see that so i i honestly don't expect it but um we'll have to see the next question is in the future will the character customizer be able to scan and import photos of your own face to generate it into a customizer that would be helpful and quicker that creates our own face from scratch that is interesting i think nba 2k did this a while back i think it's nba 2k or nba live from what I remember where you take a picture of your character of yourself and then you can import it into the game and it will generate your actual player character based off of that and they respond with face sculpting will be awesome though it's a lot of work that's a fun question I feel like being in a meeting right now we're talking more about it internally interesting so hey you never know they might actually put that in the game that is interesting but once again for those that don't know my organization phase one industries is now recruiting new and veteran players if you are interested you can find our discord in the description down below don't forget to leave a like subscribe i'll catch you guys on the next video